it is Arika Misha and today we will be cooking it up. Something quick and easy. Quick and easy, y'all. So we have our Mary B's biscuits. I love, we love the buttermilk biscuits. I like the butter biscuits too, but for this recipe, this little quick recipe try, um, I went with the buttermilk biscuit. And once again, this is a Mary B's 20 count biscuits. Y'all should have seen those in my grocery haul. And I have the Heinz home style gravy country style sausage. It's like a old school country style gravy with some sausage in it. We have it. In case y'all don't realize it by now, we are having biscuits and gravy for uh, breakfast. Biscuits and gravy. Easy, quick, let me show y'all that again. Easy, quick uh, recipe. I'm gonna go ahead and cook our biscuits up and then we're gonna heat our uh, gravy up. That's it, voila, magic. Okay, so I've got my pan here with my aluminum foil. Y'all know I put the aluminum foil, less mess, less cleanup, because we ain't got all that. And I'm gonna take my oil, my old faithful Publix canola oil. I got that, spray that so my biscuits won't stick. Go ahead and get our biscuits open. <clears throat> okay, and this is how the biscuits look. Show y'all how they look, bring it in close for y'all. Show y'all that other side. Little flat side, nice size. We just gonna lay them down in our pan. Hold on, let me make sure y'all can see my pan. Okay, just gonna lay them down. Easy. This too easy, y'all. This too easy. Too easy. Y'all can make biscuits anytime y'all want. Let's get some frozen biscuits. Biscuits and gravy. This is gonna be good, y'all. This is going to be, this is going to be le excelente. I don't even think that's a word, y'all, but. <laughs> all right. Okay, y'all. All right, let's get our biscuits all going the right way so everything can cook up all pretty. Y'all know presentation is everything. Word of the day. Presentation is everything. How you present yourself is everything. All right, now. All right, so. Those are our biscuits all nice and easily laid out. That was too easy. Too easy. So, I'm going to go ahead and once they cook up, y'all know, y'all already know I'm going to throw a little butter across the top. So, got to put the butter on the biscuits. But anyway, so I've got my biscuits all laid out. That's so easy. And I've already got my oven preheated. Uh, let's see. Yep. It says here, preheat oven uh, 375 to 400. I did 375. So, uh, position frozen biscuits flat side down on a lightly greased pan. So, we already did that. And as y'all can see, they've got different ones. They've got the, uh, Mary B's has the Southern Biscuit, Southern Made, and then she's got the Butter Taste, and, um, the Buttermilk, which is what I have. And it also looks like she's got some open kettle dumplings. Oh, okay, I gotta check those out. Alright, so let's go ahead and get these biscuits in the oven. Um, uh, how long they should... Gonna take. Oh, okay, okay. It says bake approximately 20 minutes or until brown and the internal temperature reaches a minimum of 165. Okay, so 20 minutes. All right, I'm gonna put these in the oven. I'm gonna set that timer up, and then when I come back, um, I'll show you guys how we're just gonna heat up our gravy. This is easy, y'all. Cook your biscuits, heat your gravy up. Then when the biscuits come out, cut the biscuits open, lay your gravy across it. Just, just too easy, y'all. I'm telling y'all, it's too easy. All right, let me uh, get these biscuits in the oven, and then I'll be back to show y'all how we're gonna heat up our gravy. Let's get this gravy together. This Heinz old home style gravy, country style sausage. I'm gonna show y'all that again. In case y'all wanna get it. I think I only paid $2.30 for this. Not expensive, it is the 12 ounce. It is the 12 ounce bottle. Come on, camera. 12 ounce bottle, y'all. So 12 ounce. Shake my bottle up. I've already got my stove on. Go ahead and pour in my sausage gravy here. Now you can make it homemade. Now you want to make your gravy all homemade and stuff. That's fine. You go right ahead. In the meantime, 
I'm gonna do this little two dollar and thirty five cent bottle, twelve ounce bottle, and dump it in this pot here. That's what I'm gonna do. Cause I ain't got all day. I ain't got all day. Y'all already here. I'm washing in the background, doing all kind of stuff. So, quick breakfast. I'm gonna put the biscuits. The biscuits are in the oven. Go ahead and get my um, gravy heated up. Cut that temperature down. Get all my stuff out the jar that I paid for. All my stuff. Y'all know me. I'm going to get all my stuff that I paid for out this jar. Yep. That's what we're going to do. Get all my stuff. And as you can see, it's already heating up. So, I'm going to go ahead and let this heat on up. It shouldn't take but a couple seconds. I'm going to taste it. See if I need to add anything. Um, I usually don't. To the uh, Heinz sauce because I don't want it too salty. Yeah, you don't want too much salt now. Don't over salt it. Then it just won't taste right. But I like the buttermilk biscuits with this gravy. Just the, the flavors together. The buttermilk biscuits and the uh, sausage gravy together. They just taste so good together. Such a great combination, I think. I like the butter, uh, butter biscuits too, but um, with the sausage gravy, I like the way the uh, buttermilk biscuits taste with this. I don't know, something about those buttermilk biscuits, you know? Something about them. They got that buttermilk flavor. And this only takes a couple seconds to heat up. I mean, it's already hot. It don't take much. You're just heating it up. You ain't, ain't got to cook nothing. You're just heating this up. I'm telling you. Some biscuits and gravy. Woo -wee. That's old school right there. That's old school. That's old school right there. Some biscuits and gravy. Oh, that's definitely going to get you full. Biscuits and gravy definitely going to get you full right there. All right. And y'all can see. I like the little pieces of sausage in there. Now, sometimes I'll cook a little breakfast sausage. I'll cook them and just cut them up real good and add them to my um, gravy. Sometimes I'll do that, you know, just to give it a little extra sausage. And you know what you can do too? You can also cut up bacon and put it in here. Do whatever you want. This your stuff. You pay for this. This your stuff. This my stuff. I can do what I want to do with it. So, you can do all kinds of stuff. Cut up bacon. Cut up some ham. You can cut up some, um, like I said, other breakfast sausage. You can do it if you want to do it the healthier way. Your turkey sausage. Your turkey bacon. Y'all go right on ahead. Turkey bacon and all that good stuff. Go right on ahead. You can do that. You know? Make it your own. What you want to do. So, but, um... Like I said, it's got plenty of sausage pieces in it. I like that. Um, but sometimes I do add, you know, add a little extra meat. So, today I'm going to leave it alone. It's got plenty of sausage in there today. All right. And that's it, y'all. That is it. For the, uh, let me taste it again. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. Yeah, see, that's what I like about the Heinz one. I always get the Heinz one. It has enough salt. You ain't got to add no more salt, be adding all that salt. You ain't got to do none of that. You ain't got to do none of that. So, our gravy is done. Two seconds to heat it up. That's all we did. So, that's it for the gravy. So, all right, guys. The next thing will be the final finale. Well, I'm bringing those biscuits out so y'all can see them biscuits. They're going to look good. So, all right, y'all. I'll be back with the final finale. Just pulled the biscuits out. They smell delicious. They look delicious let me pick one up so y'all can get the full effect of how how high they rise how high they let biscuits rise that's a nice size nice size of some biscuit and gravy you know what I ain't even got to cut these I'm just gonna put a biscuit and gravy right over the top oh yeah I'm gonna have me about two biscuits let me take y'all in so y'all can see those Miss B's biscuits great buttermilk taste add some butter across the top if you want that's up to you Take y'all in so y'all can see them really good. They are really good biscuits, guys. Good quality tasting biscuits. I don't like biscuits that taste all doughy. You know, I don't like that doughy taste. Can I get some butter taste, some buttermilk? Can I get what I'm paying you to do? Can I get my money's worth? But yeah, these Miss, Miss B's biscuits are delicious, guys. Take y'all back over to that gravy one more time. See how gravy is looking good. All nice and hot. All nice and hot. And we're just going to take it. And pour it over our biscuit. Oh, that's going to be good. That's going to be good, y'all. All right. Well, 
Y'all seen me do it, so you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha, guys. And don't forget that knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.